For our FitzBerts project, our group collaborated with Sybil, aka Nan, and began by identifying issues and problems she faced during her daily life. Through observations and discussions, we found that where Nan struggled most was with opening medication bottles, especially those which featured a child safety lock. We then identified three key issues which we wanted to address and resolve with our product. Gripping the bottle cap, squeezing the bottle cap in order to release it from the bottle, and performing the simultaneous actions of applying downwards pressure onto and turning the bottle cap. With consideration, the group began to explore routes in which the product would be able to provide the action of gripping the bottle cap and, and applying enough pressure to squeeze the bottle cap inwards. In addition to this, the product must be able to grip a wide range of bottle cap sizes as not only did NAND struggle with bottle caps, but also the caps for gardening and cleaning liquids. Her current work around this was by using a nutcracker. The pivot and arms of the nutcracker were able to provide the grip on the bottle she required and also allowed her to turn the bottle cap with relative ease. However, using the nutcracker was not a viable solution as the nutcracker would slip off the bottle cap. For ideation, we each explored different routes as to how we could combat these issues, attempting to incorporate solutions which could be achieved within our set time limits. After discussing and evaluating the suitability of each of our ideas, we began to create rough models and prototypes in order to be used for user testing. Preliminary testing of concepts with NAM provided very beneficial insights as to whether designs could be improved in the means of functionality, ergonomics and the form of the product. We had to consider how she would be able to interact with the product in addition to making it comfortable for her to hold and use without causing strain to her hand or arm. We explored different grip types and decided that a grip similar to that of a cracker would be difficult to manufacture given our chosen material for ABS. And so we decided to use rubber as an alternative. We also incorporated the finger hole similar to that of a pair of scissors in order to make the use of the product a one-handed operation. With all these considerations, evaluations and augmentations, we were able to create and develop a product which fulfilled all three criteria. The product can grip the bottle cap tightly, it can squeeze the bottle cap in order to release it from the bottle, and the product has drastically increased the ease in performing the simultaneous actions of applying downwards pressure onto and turning the bottle cap. We are very happy with the final product, Nan is happy, and so we would say that overall it is a successful project. Yay! <laughs>